director of this wonderful play called Sometimes Gay Means Happy. It's a dedication to many people I have loved and lost. It will help Broadway Cares Equity Fight AIDS. Okay, we're on in five, four, three. Good afternoon. Cole, what the hell are you doing? It's my rehearsal, I call the break. He's such an asshole. Do you have to be a jerk all the time? Mr. Washburn. I 
didn't kill my own brother. Oh, how would you think I did this? You fall. Where else did you get it? This is some shocking information for you. They were news me, you really I thought you know this. I don't have it. It's more my HIV positive. possible. father was infected by someone else. How? Without going into the details, my father strayed, cheated on me, and hurt me, and himself. And you just... I forgave him. The past is the past. I can't still get it. It's, I didn't know he was infected for a long time. I don't regret loving your father all these years with his flaws. Love is risk. It's worth it, though. And my father must have told you. Tell him his daughter said, rest in peace. And when she laughed, her laughter soothed my soul. The touch of her hand, like an angel's touch, would chase away all my fears in an instant. One day, my Princess Victoria went away with power. How I miss my princess. How I cried until the glorious day when my princess Victoria returned to me. Are you dead? Finish the story you do not have. Alas, the princess was gone for so many years. Too many years. She forgot how much she truly loved the king. The time she lost could not be regained because the king was gravely ill. Princess Crystal. Just like me, did 
So what part do you play? Crystal? Yeah. Do you like the show? Yes. Okay. Have you been in plays before? Yes. Okay. What's, so how many have you been in? Do you know? Sixteen. How many shows have you been in? Not that many, I don't think. No. <laughs> well, I think I've been in a hundred, but I've lost track. I started when I was eight. And what's your name? <laughs> uh, my name's Ian. I play Big Top. I'm enjoying it. It's going to be a good challenge for me, playing this part, so I'm excited for the challenge. Yeah. Interesting fact, I was in, in the 90s, I was in a film with um, Adam Ann and Deborah Harry, who were big 80s stars. Yeah. Yes, they are. Yeah, so I that like was exciting. Them. Oh, I like Adam. 
This is Vaughn. Uh, yeah, what's, what's, what's your real name? My real name is Corey. <laughs> what do you think of the show or your thoughts? My thoughts on the show? Um, I really, really like the show, actually. The first time I read it, I bawled my eyes out in a good way. Um, and I was like, I'm going to channel this for my character when she has to cry on stage. But yeah, I really connected to this character, actually. Um, very similar backstory, sick father. I lost him a couple years ago. So I really relate to this character and I'm um, really excited to bring her alive. And this is hi. I'm I play I'm Elizabeth no, and I play yeah. Teen Tori. Uh -huh. and, um, what do you think of the show so far? What's your thoughts? I I really like the show. I mean, it's definitely it's different like, from like, like what you're seeing like, on Broadway like, oh, now. Like, show, I mean, the only thing I can think of can kind of compare to this is like kinky boots, but like everything else is like it doesn't really talk about like gay issues and like AIDS and like this is like bringing like awareness to people, and I like that. What do you think of the show? Uh -huh. And who are you? Uh, hi, I'm Emma Peel. I'm playing Tori. And I absolutely love this show. What's really, really touching about it is that special relationship between girls and their dads, which is so beautiful. And I'm very fortunate that I have a wonderful relationship with my real dad. Um, and so getting to reconnect with my stage dad is is a really cool um, thing for me to get to do. So that's my favorite part. I am. I was born in Moose Jaw, Saskatchewan, which is a real place, by the way. I believe you. And uh, it has a giant moose. And then I grew up on the West Coast. Oh, so just outside of Vancouver in White Rock, which has a giant white rock. So. Wow, so you go to all the places that have something named for it. You have to, right? Yeah, I mean, otherwise you don't know where, where you are. You live. I'm from Phoenix and it's on fire. See? There you go. Yeah, all the time. <laughs> Or your partner? Who are you? Um, <laughs> let's see. Who am I? Running around. Um, I play Stephen Osborne. I am uh, uh, Victoria, Tori, and uh, there's a lot of hockey players. I don't know. I would say there's it's sort of a, a little back and forth as far as what my character type is. Um, you know, I'm a little hesitant about things are coming and, and uh, spending time, but at the same time, uh, I feel like I sort of sway her to forgiveness. And so it's a, it's a good thing. And uh, I'm glad to be doing a part of the show. Uh, you know, uh, had a lot of personal experience with HIV in my life as far as uh, family members, so it's really good to do stuff to, uh, you know, raise uh, money, and awareness, and just tell the story because I lived it. So it's pretty. I'm James Reed Venables. Oh, no, I'm Stephen Osborne. Ha, <laughs> ah, yes. Okay, we have a real lawyer in the cast. Who are you? Camera what thought. You? Yes. Uh, Who are you? My what name is you Matt Saxon. I'm playing Younger Vic. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. What's your thoughts on the play, the project? Well, yeah. that's probably the only thing you can get. Yeah. 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 I don't worry about it. I've read it about obviously three or four times. And the first three times, yeah, I've seen two minutes for two of the ads. And that's when I knew I was in a part of something really special. And, you know, I'm just the type of man, let alone the actor, that is. Just wanted to do anything to help. So um, I think that AIDS is still a prevalent issue in this world, and especially in this country. And I think that we can play it. And um, I'm really thinking, oh, what better way to do it? Helping the fun. No, I think it's great. Okay. One of my brothers died in '86. It's all the old Numa sisters. Oh, so you. So I'm very familiar. Right. It's been a long road. Final night. I will amend suddenly. Last summer.